Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 6. Today we're going to be talking about tomorrow's episode, which is episode 13, and also we've got some promotional material for the next episode, which is episode 14, coming up the week after. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new, so you don't miss any DCTV videos later this year. Okay, so tomorrow's episode is titled The Gauntlet, we have a synopsis, we have some photos, which we're going to go through and also briefly talk about the trailer. So the trailer basically teases that Team Supergirl are going to be going out fighting a dragon because there is another dragon back in National City and there's something about them being overly courageous and the trailer is quite comedic. It doesn't seem nowhere near as like harsh hitting as last week's Azzy led episode of obviously it was all about Kelly and so the tone of the trailer does feel a bit weird considering we're coming off that episode but nevertheless I'm still looking forward to it and so let's go over the synopsis for this episode so this is episode 13 coming tomorrow night Supergirl must pass the test of courage Supergirl and team race Nixley for control of a magic totem that controls courage Supergirl and Nixley battle each to get a piece of the totem, but learn the first person to pass the test of courage will gain control of the entire thing. Meanwhile, Lena is still struggling to make sense of her newfound gift. So I've talked about this a little bit previously, but obviously this episode is about the test of courage. That's what you got in the trailer. The team trying to be all courageous when fighting against the dragon, who I presume is of magical origins, and that's how they are coming into the sort of picture in this episode so yeah it kind of makes sense the trailer now that I think of it and that's what Team Supergirl are going to be racing against Nixley to do I guess that they need to show courage and show that they are worthy of this totem in order for them to get it before Nixley gets it because she's going to be trying to get it at the same time and that's why there is the race going on in this episode and meanwhile Lena is going to be struggling to make sense of her new magical powers this is obviously going to play a big part later in the season when facing off against Nixley when they're going to try and take her down because now Lena is going to be the one with powers and that's going to be very exciting and obviously she's not going to believe it properly at first but I reckon she's going to learn to use her powers pretty quickly. Okay so let's move on to the next thing so they released some photos for tomorrow night's episode and after this we'll go on to next week's episode where they've released a synopsis and they've also released photos, so we've got a lot of stuff to go over still. So the first photo of tomorrow night's episode, episode 13, The Gauntlet, is of Lena, and she is reuniting with Supergirl post her trip from Newfoundland, which is Ireland in this case. And so she's coming back, and could it be that Lena is divulging and telling Supergirl about all of the stuff that she experienced in Newfoundland? And is she telling her about her powers? It would make sense if Supergirl is the one to console her and kind of train her to maybe use her powers or use it in a good way, you know. And so let's move on to the next photo. So back in the fortress, we have Lena, who is also there with Kara, who is fully suited up in her Supergirl suit. Their face look like they're shocked, so they're seeing something. I don't know if it's on like a projection or if it's actually in the fortress, but something kind of bad is going down, I would presume. And then if we move on to the next photo, we've got Team Supergirl, that being Supergirl, Jean, and Alex, and they are facing off against someone inside an office building. I believe this is in fact the dragon, or maybe it's Nixley in this case, but I know this is literally in the exact room as the dragon in the trailer. So we have another shot of them actually looking up at the dragon, trying to be courageous, but as you can see on Supergirl's face, she's still quite scared. And so we've got more of Supergirl talking to Lena as she supposedly consoles her and they talk about all of the stuff that has just gone down with Lena so I'm now very convinced that she's probably going to tell her about her powers. Okay so let's move on to the next photo. We've got this, it's Nixley and presumably maybe a young Mixie or maybe someone that she knew from the past because this is definitely not on earth and it looks like it's in some sort of dreamscape and maybe this is part of the challenge she has to be courageous and maybe step up to her father who is maybe off screen I would reckon that it's something like that that is her test while Team Supergirl has to face off against a dragon and like a threat and prove that they are courageous heroes 
And so back in the tower, we have Jean, we've got Lena as well who is joined by Brainy and they are looking towards someone and probably having a conversation. It's nice to see Lena joining in with the team. So outside we have Supergirl who is again probably facing off against the big magical dragon and her hair is all backlit by the night lights of the city and we have one last final photo of Alex and also Kelly suited up in her new guardian suit they are aiding Supergirl outside. Okay so let's move on to the next episode this is next week's episode magical thinking and this is how the synopsis goes this is episode 14. Lena must accept her newfound powers in order to help the super friends. Lena is uncertain about using her magical abilities to help Supergirl retrieve the second totem from Nixley. William struggles to write a story on the super friends that makes both the heroes and Andrea happy. Meanwhile Kelly is thrilled Esme has found a new home but things go awry and the little girl's future is put in danger. Okay, so we have talked about the synopsis as well, so I'm going to keep this short but sweet, but mainly go over the photos, because you guys are definitely interested in that. But Lena is going to be getting her powers and actually using them in this episode, however she is going to be struggling to accept these powers because it's something completely brand new to them, but it is a necessity that she gets a hold of her powers and at least is able to use them to help Supergirl retrieve the second totem from Nixley, so from that you can assume that she probably got the Courage Totem in tomorrow night's episode. But also in regards to this, William is going to be doing his thing over at Catco, and Kelly is going to be helping out Esme, the young orphan girl that you saw a couple of episodes ago, and so that storyline with Kelly is continuing on, which I think is a very good thing. But in the meanwhile, everything is all to do with Nixley. Nixley is the main villain for the season, that is pretty much confirmed right now. They're going to be going after all these totems and episode by episode Nixie is probably going to get them. Maybe Team Supergirl does get a couple of them, but it's more than likely that Nixie is somehow going to get her clutches on them. And that's where Team Supergirl is going to come and try and stop her. And as I mentioned earlier, I think Lena, as this synopsis emphasizes, is going to be a huge thing in trying to stop her and put an end to Nixley's wrath on earth. Okay so let's move on to the photos for this episode. So we haven't talked about these, these are brand new that have just been released for episode 14. So the first photo sees Lena again in the tower so as we just said she's going to be playing a big part to do with taking Nixley down and helping out team Supergirl because she's now an official member and Nia is here fully suited up and she has a mask on inside so that is for a specific reason probably and we'll get into that in just a moment but Supergirl is here right by the table as well and so in the next photo we've got Supergirl standing in front of a board which basically charts all the totems and the different sort of powers I guess you could call them so courage, humanity, truth, destiny, love, dreams and hope you can presume we're probably going to get an episode on all of these, so that would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven episodes leading from tonight's episode onwards. So tonight's episode is episode 13, and then the final episode is episode 20. So I presume maybe we're going to be, you know, having an episode getting one of these every time. Although that might be a bit of like a drag because it's a bit repetitive. But we'll see, maybe that's the way that they're structuring the rest of the season. But the photos that they have printed off in the background stuck up are all kind of like symbols of these things. So like symbols of courage, symbols of humanity and blah blah blah. You can't really see the relevance in a lot of them because we can't see them very good and we don't know the proper reasoning for them. But it's all very symbolic and I'm sure there's a proper good reason why they got it up there. But it also reminds me of like one of those boards, you know, you get in TV shows where people are coming up with theories and there was that meme from a while ago, which it definitely reminds me of. Okay, so let's move on to the next photo. We have William here, and William doesn't know about any of Team Supergirl's identities, so it doesn't really matter that Lena is here. However, it seems that he knows that Alex is working there because Alex doesn't have her superhero costume on. But it must be noted that Nia has her mask on. Obviously, that's because they are colleagues, and I guess she doesn't want to be outed as Dreamer. But I'm unsure if Supergirl is going to reveal her identity to William in this episode and I don't know why William is there perhaps to interview them 
or he's actually there helping out with the team. Seems like he's going to be there for a chunk of the episode, so I'm going to wager the bet that I think it's kind of likely Supergirl, by the end of the episode, will reveal her identity as Kara to William. I'm not saying the same thing is going to happen with Nia, because, I don't know, maybe Nia feels more strongly about keeping her secret identity, but I just feel like it's more likely that Supergirl is going to reveal her identity to William in this episode. Okay, so we got this photo of Kara, she's smiling, she's laughing, and this seems to be like a kind of family meetup where it's like all of the friends and they're just playing games, maybe it's game night again. Okay, so let's move on to the next photo. We've got the whole team, including William, and they are in the tower, and they look shocked because they're seeing something on the big screens they got there. So it's probably some sort of development about what Nixley is doing in the city to try and get this totem. And talking of Nixley and Chaos, look in the background here, everyone seems to be fighting, and the second totem that they are after in this episode is, in fact, the Humanity Totem. Or at least that is the structure that is structured on the board. And so Supergirl is calling for backup, it seems. Okay, so we got a photo of Kelly and Alex fully suited up in their superhero suits, and they look very happy to be teaming up together because it seems like Alex is kind of on the similar playing field to Kelly now, that they have sort of overcome their squabbles in the last couple of episodes. And back at the tower, we have Lena helping out the team in a more scientific manner, it seems. However, when you look closer, you can see that she is trying to do some sort of magic because she's got this book and it looks like the book that she was potentially going to be given in the last episode. So maybe she is trying to utilize her magic as the synopsis teases. Okay, so let's move on. The next photo is of Supergirl. She's outside. There is someone in the background and it seems like they're in some sort of alley. So she's presumably facing off against Nixley, who has taken down this person in the background. I don't know if she has some sort of big significance, but we'll have to wait and see. So that's about it for this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video, and hopefully you guys are ready for tomorrow night's episode. Also, for the next week's episode, I'm sure they're going to release a trailer, because they have started releasing trailers again, which is very good. And I'm sure we're going to do a trailer breakdown of sorts. But for now... Thank you guys so much for watching, please be sure to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed the video, it really helps out getting the word out to do with the video. Also subscribe and turn on notifications if you are new to not miss any videos. And you can click on the top right corner of the screen to watch my latest video, but for now, I'll catch you guys later, goodbye. I see red.